Hey guys, welcome back. We're gonna play Until Dawn, and I think he's freezing, so let's get him inside that freezing cold ice box so we can get to the cabin. We're gonna hear the story of prom. Here we go. Right. Adventure begins. Oh, right thing to do. What? You know, get everyone together on the anniversary. You know, Josh seemed really pumped about us all doing something, didn't he? Yeah, no, he definitely did. I haven't seen him so excited about something in forever. Good, good. It's hard to tell with him, and I I didn't mean what I said. No, no. Aww. Bro, good talk. <laughs> you know what? Let's just let's just stop talking about what happened and enjoy the trip. <sighs> yeah. You know how Josh and I met? <gasps> Story time. Everyone be quiet. Third grade. Josh sat in the back of the room. I sat in the front. We didn't even know each other existed. But the kid sitting next to Josh started strap snapping the training bra on the girl in front of him. So the teacher made him move to the front, where I would be. So I got moved to the back. And? And next to Josh. That's how we met. I mean, and became friends to this day. Match made in heaven. If it weren't for the fact that Jeannie Simmons hit puberty like three years early, you know, that day he decided to wear a low cut shirt that showed off the train bra. Why would you do that? Who knows? You could that's be my question. In the car alone. Right now. Or or talking to some other person entirely. Boom. <laughs> they like to use that, don't they? We made it! Okay, who's this lady? Confident, Jess, make, uh, Mike's new girlfriend, trusting, irreverent. I don't, I'm not sure what that word is either. Okay. Confident. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. New people. Time to meet and greet. Nope, wrong way, girly. What the hell? Jess! Hey! Jessica, over here! Uh, are you guys having a really weird stroke? We're stuck in this stupid thing. Can you please let us out? Could you please? I did it! I pushed a button. Oh my god. I thought we were gone. There's another ten minutes in there and I would have chewed off my own leg. Oh, thanks, Chris. Look. Oh, hey. <laughs> well, well, well. What do we have? Chris. My goodness. Seems that someone has a little crush on our good friend and dear class president Michael Monroe. Chris. And it was pretty, ain't it? Seriously, couldn't they have built the lodge like right Can you hear these people? people? Emily, Mike's ex. Intelligent, resourceful, persuasive. Whatever. Okay. I don't think it would have been like as pretty. Matt, Emily's new boyfriend. Motivated, ambiguous, active. And where's the bellboy when you need one? She's one of those girls. Matt, I'm sorry for you. Getting chills. We're almost there. No, I mean, getting kind of creeped out. Oh, yeah. It's going to be weird seeing everyone up here again. Definitely not going to feel like a regular party. I mean, what do you think? <laughs> Mike, Emily's ex, in intelligent, driven, Perseverity. Whatever. Thank you. <laughs> you got it. Michael! You really, really should have seen your faces right there. Dude, I almost clocked you just now. <laughs> Michael, 
though you're a jerk. Come on, guys. We're all friends here, right? No need for violence. Just a little harmless fun. Well, the woods, spooky. Come on, let's get into the spirit of things. The spirit of things? Seriously, what's wrong with you? I like I'm Mike. Like in the mood, Em. Don't be like that. Like what? Just the way you're being. You always get like this. Michael, you gotta step off. Emily and I are together now, and that's just the way it is. I'm not gonna tell you again. Do we understand each other? Well, I thought maybe we could move past all this. We budge, but yeah, fine. Mike. No, no, no. I think you got the message. It's kinda hot when you get all alpha, you know that? the rest of the way. The bags? Yeah. All the bags. Oh. Why? There's only two. I need to go find Cam. Okay. Sorry, I just, I really need to go find her. I totally forgot I needed to talk to her before we get all the way up there. I just really can't wait. We're almost there. It's important. Matt, please. Um. It's in the middle of the woods and it's creepy. I really don't think you should head back down the trail by yourself. Seriously? It's cold out, and it's getting dark. You're gonna protect me from it being dark out? Oh. I'll just leave your stuff here and come with you. Nobody's gonna steal it. Matt, are you kidding me? You can't leave me alone for five minutes? You really think that little of me? That's not Oops. What I meant. Why can't you just listen to me? Why do you have to question everything I say? I'm sorry, Em. I'm just trying to be helpful. If you want to be helpful, then you can help get everything up to the lodge as quickly as you can, okay? Oh. Oops. Okay. Fine. Whatever you want. Thank you. I'll see you up there after I go find Sam. See you there. Oops. They had a love fight. I forget what the other words for it is. Uh, Sam respected Chris's privacy. Chris was happy to see Sam. Chris was happy to see Sam. Chris controlled to trust Sam. Chris chose not to shoot the squirrel. Nature remained in balance. Okay. Dude, who's this? Ashley has a crush on Chris. Aww. I don't know what that word is. The top one. Or the second one. Fourth right. She does the right thing. They honestly, they look like they're talking. Gotta be truthful. He needs to know. Um, sure, uh, go, go ahead. Knock yourself out. Yes. Uh, Miss Lee, Emily? What the hell, man? Hey, listen, it's probably nothing. Nothing you think? Well, yeah. Is it ever just 
nothing with him? Ever? I don't know. I <laughs> Damn it. Matt. She seems to be one of those girls that check her phone. So let's. But we need to save some battery on it. So let's read a book. I think he should hit me a few times with a snowball. Doing nothing is the be the right thing to do. He got me. Ah, no, you missed. like each other. Wow. Save some for later, buddy. Endless reserve. <laughs> we should get up to the lodge. Yeah. It's so nice out here, though. Pretty breathtaking. I mean, I could stay out here pretty much ever, provided I was hanging out with you the whole time. Just... Ashley encouraged Matt to use the telescope. Matt saw Mike and Emily flirting. Oh, so it wasn't friendly. Okay. It was flirty. Okay. Men worry me or women were ah. Uh. Crowds. Oh, yeah. Heights or the fear of drowning, the fear of heights. Uh, snakes or rats? I kind of like rats more than snakes. Guns or knives? Uh, 
Well, a gun, you would, you could be far away and shoot the person, but with a knife, you gotta get up and personal. So I think knives. Creepy crawlies. Oh, clowns scare me or scarecrows scare me. Ah. Clowns. Scare. Crows are scary. Gore disgusts me. No. Maybe. I'm still being honest. But okie dokie. Uh, speeders. Uh, I. Needles as much anymore. I don't. I love dogs. Sorry. I love thunderstorms. Creepy. Oh, well, I'm afraid. Once again, we're out of time. Uh, and we're out of time here, too. But once again, I hope you guys enjoyed this playthrough, and I'll see you next time. Bye!